Hey guys, this is Juan from Team Sketch to React. Let me show you something. So, this is my project. Uh, is SVG things. Uh, have them here in a code app. I export it to HTML. And let's, let's check this out. We have the, the thing here. It's here, it works, awesome. But, uh, you should do this. Uh, when you have everything working, everything is finished, make sure to export the SVGs, say that you're working on a prototype or something. Uh, you want things to work really well in code, so make sure you export these ones and use the plugin that is called SVG Compressor from Sketch. What this does, it takes away a lot of unnecessary stuff from the code so let's this is the exported SVGs from sketch directly from our code app uh, via something called sketch tool and it gives you a lot of stuff here when you have done these the compression they go down in size and they are a lot cleaner you know this is how they should look. So let's just do this. Let's select, this is the optimize SV, SVGO compress file. Let's go to our blue here and just take everything away and just input the compressed code. Let's do the same thing from Aqua here. Let's do that. Aqua, let's take everything away. Boom. Purple, purple, purple. Like that. Boom. Let's save and check this out. If everything looks nice, nice and neat. It's still awesome. Uh, but you have a lot cleaner code. You should aim for that. Uh, let's try something out here. Um, let me do this with this one here. Uh, let's have this one. No, that one here. Uh, let me check this out. Let's try something out. So, Aqua. This is Aqua 1. Change the text. Hello world! And if you have changed stuff like this, uh, I mean I actually changed inside the SVG here. Uh, sometimes you really, you actually need to restart the... Ignore this, this is no problem. Uh, new terminal, npm, start, like that. It should start. Hello world. So you need to rethink the SVGs because uh, you're actually inside the code here. Uh, why did I do this? Because uh, you can actually do a lot of cool things with SVG. You could uh, animate them for example and then this is much easier if you're going to animate these afterwards in code. I found some tutorial somewhere uh, showing how to animate uh, SVGs with just CSS for example. You can do a lot of cool stuff. I'm going to experiment with uh, animating this with CSS inside of Sketch to React of course. Uh, that is even easier. Uh, but that's all for me right now. Cheers guys!